Mindset Act Part 24, one part series, how to shift your mindset to overcome imposter syndrome. Welcome back to part two of our series on dealing with imposter syndrome. In part one, we talk about what imposter syndrome is and how it shows up for beginners. Now let's dive into practical ways you can shift your mindset to stop feeling like an imposter. The first step is overcoming imposter syndrome is to refrain self-doubt. When you feel like an imposter, it's usually because you're learning something new or pushing through your limits. Instead of seeing self-doubt as a sign that you are a fraud, view it as a sign of growth. Remember, feeling uncomfortable is a part of learning process. The fact that you're challenging yourself means you're growing. Imposter syndrome makes you forget your achievements or don't play them. One way to come back to this is to keep a success journal where you write down your wins, big or small. This serve as a reminder that you've earn your place and you're capable of success. Reflecting on your progress helps you to see that you're not an imposter. You have worked hard for your accomplishments. As a beginner, it's important to embrace the learning process rather than expecting perfection. Imposter syndrome strives on unrealistic expectation, but the truth is no one knows everything right away. Allow yourself to be a learner and give yourself permission to make mistakes. Progress over perfection is the mindset that will help you grow without feeling like an imposter. What's one of the achievements you're proud of that imposter syndrome has tried to downplay? Share in the comments. In part three, we'll cover strategies to continue overcoming imposter syndrome, even when those feelings creep back in. So make sure to subscribe so you won't miss out. My name is Jacqueline Young Landy with JYL Image and Lifestyle. I'm all about creating the life you deserve in your image so you rock your style, whatever you wear, in your wellness. You feel great and energized from the inside out, even at my age, 60, and in your lifestyle so you live the life you deserve. Okay. You see that subscribe button? If anything resonates with you, please like. And please comment. Anything that you, you want me to talk about, leave in the comment. And please share, guys. Share with your friends and your family. And the bell button, that is the notification button so you won't miss any of my videos. See you in the next video. I can't wait to share whatever I know with you. Thanks for joining, guys. Go have an awesome, awesome day, evening, or night. Take care. Bye for now. Are you still here? Go click that button, the bell button, and subscribe so you won't miss any of my videos because I have several parts to go. Stay tuned for the next video. Bye for now. This is my look for today. The colors are khaki or beige, black and tan and brown. All winter colors. This is creating my look, my bag to wear, my bag to wear at lunchtime with my husband and my shoes to sew on the machine. Let's create this look. So this is what gave me the inspiration for dressing here in Florida during winter time. So this is my bag I'm going to wear. And this is what I'm going to wear over uh, when I'm going for lunch with my husband at whatever time. This little top with all these um, graffiti on there. And I just love it because I love the colors that it picks up in my outfit. That's great. Let's look. This so is sheer. I'm going to wear this over it. It's a long top. It's, you know, it's not too warm for 
Florida, but I'm just going to use it to camouflage this. Oh, this is good. It has rouging, it has pockets, it has slits, it's everything I love. This is my necklace. It picks up the black and the beige tone and matching earrings. Yeah. I'm going to wear these shoes, my famous shoes. I love the chunky ears. But I'm going to take this with me because when I'm sewing, um, this gets caught on the machine. So this is easier for me to sew. The gist of the story is let go what doesn't serve you anymore. And start showing up. Oops as your true you, your true self, in your style. Because as my book says, this is not a practice life. This is the life that you do with. Hey okay, guys, off to work. Do you like this look? This bag on a trip quite a few seasons ago, but I didn't wear it yet. But what I'm thinking of taking off this with a lot of embroidery and create like a clutch. So I'm going to pull this apart. So I finished the bag and it's um, <clears throat> lying inside. I have like a zipper area for my money. You can carry it like this, or you can carry it like this. <coughs> Excuse me.